Come on. Come on, here he is. <laughs> I'm pretending like I'm embarrassed about this, but I'm soaking every second of it up. Like, stop it, fellas, stop it. <laughs> Mate, uh, forget about the win. You're the story. Everyone wants to talk to Nathan Grimer. I don't think you've ever done that many interviews in your life. <laughs> no, I'm not usually the first bloke they get for a post-match interview. Um, um, and I didn't actually play that well today. I was labouring a bit with a sore foot after quarter time. Um, I only went four. I actually had the vest at three quarter time. <laughs> And I went out and I was limping around and they, I think they just wanted to make use of me. So put me to the 10 metre, inside 10 metres and uh, you know, the rest is history, I guess. <laughs> a lot of people talk about, you know, how many games you've played before you kicked your first goal and a couple of games ago you had that chance yeah. and you, you laid it up and you yeah. missed. Talk us through this one, mate. Uh, well, they were saying during the week that the record in the history of the club without a goal 72 games. Uh, and today obviously was my 72nd game, so the boys are saying during the week if we get a chance want to try and not let me get that record because I don't really want that record and uh, yeah and actually I was talking to Boomer was going to try and give me a cheeky little hit up he said but we didn't get the chance and then I only went forward because of the foot um, yeah I don't know just well, I think a bit of carry on really when it's all said and done I think Wellesley tried to hit you up yeah. first and it spilt yeah. But then you got that second opportunity and you made good. Yeah, I, when Wells came out of the centre and hit me up, I should have marked it. Um, I wasn't feeling the foot too much then, I can tell you. The limp went and I just come up at the footy and spilled it. Um, and I thought I'd blown my chance. And uh, the footy gods, mate. They... <laughs> <laughs> what about the celebration, mate? Like, too far. You... Yeah, I took it too far. So I'm a bit embarrassed about that. I'm looking forward to getting me phone at the moment. I reckon I'll have... 100 text messages just taking the piss out of me, but um, oh, I practice those celebrations at training a little bit, but um, yeah, I don't know, I got caught up in the moment and everyone ran from everywhere, all that knackered afterwards that they kicked about the next three goals, I think, <laughs> we're all that puffed out. Well, credits to Lockie Hanson, he ran all the yeah. way from full back to come and give you a congratulations. Oh, I felt very loved actually, um, yeah, it's probably, as silly as it sounds, it's probably one of the more enjoyable moments of my career, well, obviously it's my only goal, but just the reaction from the lads. I think I had a tear in my eye for you at one stage, just <laughs> but it's not about me. <laughs> Were you shaking afterwards? Uh, I said to my opponent, I reckon I've got time to kick two or three here, and he didn't like that too much. <laughs> I've had that arrogant once I went forward. <laughs> Good on you, man. Well the done. man's that pump. Look at him. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Monty. Can we ask you a question? Oh, come on, come in here. The proud moment for the family is going for it. Monty, uh, yeah. you must be proud of him, mate. Yeah, no, I am what proud of him. Very proud of him. Oh, are you with your <laughs> I'm very proud of him, mate. He's done well. Did you think he was a chance when he went forward? Oh, no doubt. He can kick goals, actually, if we give him a chance. Ooh, that is a slur to the coach. Yeah, that's a slur to the coach. <laughs> Cut. Good on you guys.